All of the activities that Zachary has been a part of have allowed him to see that um, he's not alone and that there are other kids and other families that are going through the transplant journey, if you will. Did the STARS program make a difference in Mara's life? I definitely think it has. I think um, it has been wonderful, you know, to have the monthly meetings, to be able to uh, connect with other uh, um, transplant patients, other uh, children who have gone through the same thing as she has. Um, you know, when you were in high school and you're the only one that you know that's had a transplant, you can kind of feel isolated a little bit, but knowing, you know, there's other uh, uh, children your age that are going through the same thing, and then seeing some of them, you know, excel, they will become adults, they, you know, have jobs, they've gotten married, they, you know, that just gives you some hope for, the, you know, for what's in your future. You're with others, you know, going through the same things you're going through, and... Uh... And typically, you haven't gone through this before, it's new, so, you know, Transplants for Children offers the support, but the education of what to expect in certain situations as you go through transplant. Did the STARS program help you understand the importance of being ready for transitioning from pediatric to adult in the transplant medical system? Yes, it definitely yeah. helped, especially when it came to learning how to, you know, manage your doctor's appointments and medications as well. Um, when I was a STAR, uh, in STAR program, they showed us a little bit about uh, bills mm -hmm. and how to manage your money and your time. It definitely worked. The whole the whole program worked to help me the transition from high school to college, and it was a really nice uh, thing for me yeah. because you know you're in high school, you don't know what to do, and once you're in college, you're like, okay, what's next? And how do you feel about the scholarship opportunity that STARS program offers uh, to Mark? That's amazing. I mean, when she, uh, when she started, she was a sophomore in high school, and of course, COVID hit, so everything went virtual. And so, but she, grown, she, she did graduate last year, started her first year at Northwest Vista, and received the scholarship. So yes, the scholarship program is amazing. And how did the scholarships you earned from STARS help you in life or in schooling? It really helped when I went to college because those books are expensive. So yeah. I used them towards books and I think some of it towards housing when I was, when I was living off uh, on campus at school. So it really did. It really came in handy. Uh, the scholarship helped me when I went to culinary arts at St. Phillips College. Um, I got an associate's degree and the money helped me buy uh, some tuition and some of my school books and I still have some of my school books so it's a pretty good reference. The scholarship helped me a lot when it came to the books and uh, the computer okay. and um, it, it, it really helps because some people think that college is like easy it's like high school but in reality it's not because you have separate uh, uh, payments you have to do just for the little things for the books or for like for if you want to download apps or just the little fees that the teacher gives you, but that money counts a lot. I know he looks up to all of the mentors and um, Ricky, and you know he, he he sees them involved in the program, and it's it's something that he admires. So that he wants to do that too. And how does it make you feel that Mara is going to be coming back as a mentor for the STARS program? I'm very excited. I'm very <laughs> proud of her. I'm excited and proud for her. I mean, yes. uh, I think she'll do an amazing job. She's yes. definitely high-spirited, so I think she'll bring that to the program. The reason I am in STARS is to show kids, younger generation, anybody I can, that this is not a setback. You can still do what you want to do. It's a little bit harder, but it's worth it. 
The reason why I became a SARS mentor is because I want to interact and meet new people that have gone through the same journey and let them know that they're not alone and that we're always going to be there to help them in any situation they can. If you had to pick one thing that makes you proud to be a SARS mentor, what would it be? I would say um, making a, their lives different. Mm -hmm. I just want to leave an impact on them because being a transplant recipient myself and going through that process as a being a child, it's not easy. Mm -hmm. Especially because through the treatments, people look at you different and you think you're alone. But once you're growing, you're growing up and you find this type of place like the transplant organization and you know that it has the same thing as you, you feel like you're not alone. What was my favorite part about being stars was probably uh, all the friendships that I made. I mean, I was there for like maybe five years and to this day some of them are still my friends and it's awesome.